Good morning, good morning, good morning. Welcome, welcome to a new day. We're still in Yangon, or Yangon. Mum keeps calling it Yangon, it's getting in my head, it's Yangon. Today is a slightly more chilled out day. We're going on the river, which should be quite exciting. And I think we're gonna have a little museum day. There's a drugs elimination museum, which sounds really interesting and ties in with my fascination for drugs and crime and criminology type stuff. And then there's the National Museum. I don't know much about the country, so hopefully I'll learn quite a lot today. Maybe you will too. Had a bit of a scare last night. My laptop wouldn't charge. Um, obviously I edit videos and I keep in contact with people through my laptop and procrastinate by watching YouTube videos on my laptop. The laptop is charging now, the light's on, but it wasn't on last night. <laughs> Please excuse the redness that's going on here, I don't know. We went to go and find an Apple place to get a charger for my broken laptop, as I mentioned before. We went up and down trying to find a place that sold Apple pro any Apple products. Everywhere sells Samsung, Philips, Sony, you name it, they sell it, but they don't sell bloody Apple. Yeah, we found an Apple sign that said it's authorised Apple seller. I'm like, yes, finally, woo! We go inside, we don't sell Apple here, and gave us an address, which is uptown, which is like past the airport, it's well over an hour away and I'm like, I'm not going there. We're hot and sweaty by this point. We're tired, we don't, we're exhausted and it's like half past 10, we don't want to do it anymore. We then came to this mall by the Studio Pagoda, which we went to yesterday, link in the description. And I'm sure I saw an Apple sign in the window and I'm sure I saw online there was something to do with a new Apple store, so we should have come here first, basically. Oh, I've got, we've got, I've just realised I've got nice music on, like, la, 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 la. We're sat in the mall now, I've got a charger. This is the most expensive piece of kit I think I've bought since my laptop. But it's proper Apple, my laptop's insured, so hopefully all is well and I can get the money back. It's just a very stressful day, we're exhausted. Mama Bear has been amazing. I think I'm just looking forward to actually doing something other than walking the streets. <laughs> we're getting there. Yeah. So now that this is done, I can shove this in my bag. We can try and get to the ferry and do a museum or something. First, we're gonna go into a supermarket, which is opposite. It looks huge and I'm very excited about it. All we've seen is little tiny convenience stores. I'll try and show you a little bit of the supermarket if I can, because phone supermarkets are always fun. Bread. What's that about? There's salt and vinegar. This mall has a huge dog as well. <laughs> so that was a little bit inside the shopping mall and the supermarket. Let's go and do some proper stuff now. We've made it to the river. The river is over here. We need to get onto a, the water bus, not a ferry or a cruise, because there's quite a big distinction between how much they cost. We're finally on track to actually doing something. Woo! Yeah, water bus. So we managed to get to the water bus station to get a ticket. The next one is at half past two, it's now ten past twelve, so that hasn't worked out. So the plan now is not to go on the water bus, but to get a taxi up to the Drugs Elimination Museum, and then we'll try and get the water bus back in the opposite direction. Oh my god. We have made it to the Drugs Elimination Museum. I'm a bit hiding behind me there. <sighs> so we got in a taxi, we agreed at 6,000, which is a bit of a rip off anyway. I mean, it's like three pounds, but it took us about 20 minutes to figure out, for them to figure out where we will actually want to go. We wanted the aircon on because it's bloody warm today. And he's going 7,000, 7,000. I'm like, no, you put the aircon on and you will get paid the same amount as before. We got here and I knew he was going to do this. I gave him 10,000, which is, I didn't have enough to give him the exact amount. He's like, oh, I have no change. And I'm like, oh, that's a shame, isn't it? You better go and find some. Gives me 3,000 change. And I'm like, no, I need one more thousand. He's like, oh, I've got no change. And I'm like, well, I'm not moving out of this car until you get me your change. And somehow two 500s appear from somewhere. I love it when she gets stroppy. I was a bit stroppy. I'm not going to get ripped off, though. We can jog on. And we got into the Drugs Elimination Museum. 
and she's muttering something about it, it being a lot more. I'm so glad I've got a currency converter on my phone because otherwise we just have no money left. Oh, this museum is huge. I thought this was just going to be a tiny little thing. I'm not even looking at anything, I'm just walking <laughs> around. <laughs> He's still having me run. There's three floors. This is crazy. So I'm going to film a couple of bits. Yeah. massively anti-drugs, I mean, understandably. I didn't realise there was such a huge trade for opium. That's not something that I've ever learned or come across before. Interesting, there's lots of cool paintings uh, and lots of pictures. The military had a huge effort to eliminate drugs and it's taken a really long time and I'm sure it's still not complete. It's like here, you've got the destruction of poppy seeds. And they've got them on fire here. Instead they were given chickens to farm. Or sunflowers? No, that's corn, that's maize. Pig farmers. That was a huge building. Um, don't really know what to say about it. Yeah, they're very proud of how they have eliminated drugs. I don't know if they have fully eliminated drugs because I don't think that's possible personally in any country. We are pooped. It's so hot as, as usual. We go down here? Yeah, okay. We'll follow you. <laughs> Got to swim to get on. <laughs> through all of these to get off. It's a nice little boat ride that was. Now off to get some snacks from the supermarket and go and chill out because I am knackered and I think Mama Bear is too. So we've made it back. I'm wearing my pyjamas again. Just had a shower feeling very refreshed. Today's been a long day. I don't know how it turned into such a long day but it did. But it has been, it has been a good day I think overall. The ferry was really cool, nice and relaxing. The drugs museum was interesting to say the least. We've been in a couple of supermarkets because I love a good foreign supermarket. Found some dairy milk so we're both extremely happy about that. So that's it for today. Hope you've enjoyed it as much as we have. Kind of because we've been stressy but we have enjoyed it. We'll see you next time. Until then, have a nice life. Be nice to people and 